here's the best bit. <laughs> um, <laughs> I'm in a slight pickle at the moment, financially, but it's my own fault. Uh, I understand that. But, uh, but I'm also into website dresses, as you know. I buy a few. Well, I've bought a few. I have a few. And uh, a website address sold yesterday. If we took this website address into any estate agent and said, what would you give me for it? Can I buy a house with this website address? They would say no. Right? If we took it into any Rolls Royce showroom, can I buy this Rolls Royce with uh, this website address? They would laugh at you and say no. Right? A website address sold yesterday for £384,000. Oh, funny that. Just as well, because it would probably cost you the Rolls Royce and a Porsche and something else, yeah? Or a house bought and paid for and a Porsche. People do not understand the value of website addresses. And it's their own... They'll lose out by not accepting website addresses, which only will accrue, accrue in value over years, not decrease. Uh... Cars decrease, so a depreciating asset, whereas website addresses are an appreciating asset. They will get more expensive over time. Um, and if you're into website addresses now, have a look at Domain Law, D-O-M-A-I-N-L-O-R-E dot U-K. Brilliant website address for .co.uk and .uk auctions. And at the moment, there are some absolute peaches since the... Uh, uh, all the uh, .UKs were available last week and there were some proper good ones available today.